The deaths of these two children represented an awful failure of our society and of our state's safety net. Governor Janet Mills took time during her State of the State to remember the lives of Marissa Kennedy and Kendall Chick, two children who died as a result of child abuse and neglect. Mills' administration has already taken steps to improve the Child Welfare Division of DHHS, adding 32 more social worker positions that have all been filled. Now, she says the state needs more. I will ask this legislature to fund another 20 positions to respond quickly and effectively to reports of abuse and neglect of our children. Some Democratic legislators say this is a great idea. We want to get kids out of those difficult situations and into a safe environment. That's first and foremost. And so to making sure that staffing levels are appropriate is critical. Some Republicans say while they agree child safety is important, there's more planning needed before adding positions. Number one is how are we going to fund it? You know, where are we going to find the money? The 32 that were hired, we had the funding for that and it was included in the biennial budget and other vacancies and so forth. But some Democrats say the funding can come from the supplemental budget and they aren't concerned about the cost. To me, we can't put a price on children's safety. And that's first and foremost. So when we're talking about making sure we have adequate staff to handle child abuse, that has to be a priority.